We've got an announcement to make. I just looked at Steve and thought, what's going on? Come in, mate. Think of it as a financial intervention. Turquoise is lovely, isn't it? For the walls? No, if it's a girl. Oh, yes. It's lovely. I really like Roger for a boy after Dad. Mm. Steve thinks it's too traditional, but no, it's it's a strong name. Dad would love it. Darling, did you want to have that chat with Andrew? Ah, uh, look, Andrew, no offence, but we're about to have a baby, so it's hardly the time to be throwing money into risky investments. Of course, but we, we can look at areas like getting the most out of your super. And... Right now it's family before Ferraris. <laughs> right. Now, I'm not interested in playing the market. It's too unpredictable. I mean, look at Wall Street. Massive hit, Oscar winner, sequel was a complete dad. That was a movie. Based on real events. Um, yep, good point. Dad said Andrew was really great, so we should at least hear him out. Well, if Roger says so. What's that? Nothing. Surprised that Lucy's father wants to impose his financial model on us? Not really. He wants... Time to turn those. Thanks, Roger. Dad has been really great. He actually helped us find the house and he loaned us some money to put down for the deposit. Didn't he, darling? Yes, he did. Yep. Very generous mm -hmm. is Roger. Generous of reminding me he lent us money every time he steps into our house. <laughs> this is my room, my floor, my bed, my doona. Not what I choose for myself, but mine. Ah, <sighs> my chandelier. I was just joking, of course. It was just a little joke between me and Steve. Did I mention I did economics, three unit? Excellent. Well, that will come in handy. I understand you help Roger. The thing is, I'm not Roger. You're right. That's why we'll look at plans that suit you. Me. Exactly. I'm not about to retire anytime soon. You just want the plan that gives you independence and sets up the best opportunities for your family. I mean, education is expensive. expensive. Exactly. Exactly. We just want what's best for our kids. We don't want to compromise there. <laughs> <laughs> Best for the kids. For Lucy, that means two grand designer prams with matching diamond encrusted rattles. Just the essentials. <laughs> yeah, okay, this could work for us. Kind of like what you've done here, not what I would have done, but we'll roll with it. So, we can reduce the risk by adjusting, adjusting my investment portfolio, as requested. And now we have income protection, protection. insurance. Yeah. Right, so if something should happen to Steve. Not likely, bulletproof. Exactly, but. If something did happen and he couldn't work anymore, you guys and the kids would be covered. Yeah, honey, it's kind of like Superman insuring himself against kryptonite. I have just stopped work, so it looks like Andrew's ideas will be Sorry, really helpful. Sorry, ideas? Oh, um, Andrew's. Andrew's starting points that Steve built into a skyscraper of financial security for his family. What are you talking about? Andrew laid out no, the... He laid out the foundations, but you can't live in foundations, can you? Steve Jr is going to live in the penthouse with uninterrupted views of financial prosperity. 